he's one of the most interesting figures of the Dakar. Before driving a truck, Jan Lammers had an impressive career, and it all started in the sand of northern Netherlands. Well, this is actually Zandvoort. It's the, the outside of Zandvoort. Uh, and uh, this is where I played, you know. As a kid, it was either the beach or the sand dunes. And first, you know, on your bicycle, you go through the dunes, then on your motorbike. So it was just one big play garden for me. The other playground of Lammers, the famous Zandvoort circuit, is where he conquered his first triumphs. It all started with a European title in Formula 3 before he reached the summits of motorsports and Formula 1, taking part in 23 Grand Prix. My biggest souvenir here is my first Grand Prix uh, because it's the first time that uh, you can show your family what you're doing. Uh, so your Formula 1 car, the Formula 1 race. Uh, so I think that's my biggest memory here, to just be able to share it with my home crowd. The highlight of his career came in 1988 when he took his Jaguar to glory at the Le Mans 24 Hours. A universe far, far away from the Dakar. In Le Mans you have like 13 and a half kilometer, you know it. Uh, and, and the weather conditions may vary, the track conditions with a bit of oil or stuff, uh, or gravel, I mean that's about it. But in the Dakar you never know what's going to be there you know, after that hill or corner or whatever. So on one hand, you have to be prepared for everything. On the other hand, you cannot be prepared for anything because the serious situations can happen and a split decision can cause big damage for yourself and others. It's a very uh, challenging race is an understatement, of course, but therefore, because it is so difficult, uh, it is, a, you know, it's exciting. The Dakar in a truck, certainly not an expected choice, but for his seventh appearance in the class, it'll be another amazing odyssey in the wide open spaces of the Dakar. Sometimes I say you, you, you sit on the second floor, uh, that's how I feel compared to a Formula One, it's almost a third floor even. So you sit very high up and uh, for me that's a nice change because usually I, I always see everything from a low level of course with my height. Just to take a truck of nearly 10 tons up the hills. Just the energy, that's phenomenal. And, and, and then even taking the 10 tons down the hill, uh, sometimes so steep that some people roll forward, that, yeah, that's just fascinating. 